Hey guys, what's up? It's Daniel with TrailerMountain.com and today I'm testing and reviewing the anodized aluminum thumb screws that hold your GoPro in place from a company called CamKicks.com. Here's their website right here. Here's the setup right here. It also comes with a nice little uh, tool to help secure the thumb screws down. So I'm gonna get them out of the packaging and I'm gonna show you what they look like. All right, so here you go as the two small little stubbies and the one long one for securing your actual camera. I ordered the red one just because, you know, I, I like red. I think it looks really cool and I have a black case on my GoPro, so the red and black go really good together. Uh, it's also available in blue and black. So if you want to keep it all black and keep it all stealth, you can do that too. The set of three retails for about $14, so not a bad deal when you're getting high quality thumb screws. All right, so here you go right here. And you know me, I'm a big stickler on branding, so let's see if that, there we go. Camkicks.com. It comes with a little nut, and it comes with this little O-ring that goes around the threads. And what that's going to do is, for one, it's going to reduce tension on the actual plastic mounts. Plus, it's also going to reduce abrasion. And, you know, over time, if this stuff gets roughed up quite a bit, eventually it's just going to break. So that's, help, that's there to help reduce that. You could also take it off and not use it at all. Nice, high-quality, anodized aluminum. I'll kind of... Let that zoom in for a second, or autofocus. Okay, so what you do basically is you get your GoPro. I always like to put my finger here. A lot of my mounts, what I usually do is I put a little drop of crazy glue right here on this nut, because some of the mounts, the, the, the nut has a tendency to just fall right out. And then if you're outdoors somewhere, good luck trying to find it. So just a little DIY little tip. Put a little dab of uh, crazy glue on there. There's no need for even for you to even take the nut out of there. So just glue it in place. You don't have to worry about it. Then you get your guy here with the O-ring in place. It kind of doesn't really fit right. So you got to kind of have to push it in until it catches that first thread. And then once it does, then it's good. And there you go. Add a little bit of uh, style and flair to your GoPro while increasing functionality too, which is really cool. There you go. You can see how the O-ring kind of smushes down onto that. As I said, it also comes with the two little stubby ones also, and those are for the actual GoPro little extendable, flexible, you know, doodads where you can, you know, mount your GoPro in multiple angles. So it's pretty cool that they give you three of them. So you have multiple options there, and you can also, you know, make everything match and look cool and that kind of thing too. Another thing that's pretty cool is they actually give you this little GoPro style tool and it comes with a tether also and that what this does is it kind of just mounts right on here and it gives you a little bit more torque so if you can't really get this thing tight enough and you want to really get it cinched down use the little tool and it has a little hole right there on the top so you can attach the tether through it and then tether it off to something else so you don't lose it okay so that's my review of the anodized aluminum thumb screw set from camkicks.com. Here's their website right here. Make sure you check these guys out. So if you like my review and found it informative, you want to get some of these for yourself, whether you want to get the red, the blue, or the black, um, pretty cool either which way you want to go, or you want to get a GoPro case, or you want to get the clamp mount that you saw in my other video, click the link down in my description box below and make your purchase. When you do, it helps support my website. So another way you can help support me produce higher quality content is you can click the donate button on my YouTube channel. And when you do, you can donate a dollar, five dollars, ten dollars, any number of dollars. So I appreciate all the help and all the support that you guys have given me over the last couple of years. I really do and I thank you. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them down below in my comment section and I will get back to you as quickly as I can. Also too, please like, subscribe, and share on Facebook and Twitter. It really means a lot when people subscribe to my channel for one, so click the subscribe button right here. So thanks very much for tuning in to TrailerMountain.com. Please keep checking back for more gear reviews and other outdoor related hodgepodge. Take care guys, get outdoors.